Hello, this is Saki from Saki Tech. In today's video, I'm going to demonstrate how to make and receive calls from the Apple Watch. Now, just to be crystal clear, you can only make or receive calls using the Apple Watch as long as both devices are paired via Bluetooth and you are within the Bluetooth range, which is approximately 10 meters. So let's dive in and one by one show you everything you can do on the Apple Watch relating to phone calls. Also check out my video which is titled 50 plus tips and tricks for the Apple Watch which covers every little detail of the Apple Watch so you can master it. The link for that video is in the description below. Alright so the first thing I'm going to show you guys is how to receive phone calls on the Apple Watch. Now when somebody calls you on your iPhone your Apple Watch will also ring. Now normally you will be wearing your Apple Watch on your wrist, so simply raise your wrist when you get a call. In this case, I'm just going to tap on the screen and there we go. It shows the incoming call. To answer the call, simply press answer. And what's going to happen is the Apple Watch is going to take over. So the Apple Watch has a built-in speakerphone and a microphone. So you can talk directly into the Apple Watch to have a conversation with anybody which means if your iPhone was in your pocket you can keep the iPhone in the pocket and simply use Apple Watch to communicate with that person which is absolutely fantastic. You don't always have to answer the phone so if somebody calls you, I'm gonna do this one more time, if somebody calls you what you can do is you can respond to them using your Apple Watch by sending a message. Swipe up to bring up the hidden menu and tap send a message and from here you can uh, pick one of the presets and as soon as you tap on it it ends the call and sends a text message to the caller telling them what you just told them in the text message you can also place a call on hold so if somebody calls you all you do is let me tap on that pull up that secret menu and click answer on iPhone when you do that that does not answer the phone call it simply puts the call on hold until you accept it on your iPhone. So this is how you put a call on hold but as soon as you accept it on the iPhone then the call is active. Also once you accept a call on the Apple Watch you have a couple options that you can play with. So let's accept that call and as you can see there's a couple buttons there. You can actually click the mute button to mute the call. This mute the, mutes the call, the microphone on your Apple Watch and on your iPhone so whatever you say does not go to the other side. So This is how you mute a call. And if you want to unmute the call, simply re-tap on that button and you're back in business. By the way, once you accept a call, if the speaker phone on the Apple Watch is either too high or too low for you to hear, you can adjust the volume by tapping the minus or plus sign and that's going to either decrease the volume of the speaker phone on the Apple Watch or increase the volume on the Apple Watch's uh, speaker phone. And finally, I'm going to show you guys how to actually make a phone call. Now, make sure that you understand, before you make a phone call, you have to actually go into the Apple Watch app and scroll down to where it says Friends. And from here, you can add anybody. So I have a couple of people added. And as long as these friends are added on your My Watch app on the iPhone, they are going to show on the Apple Watch when you press the side button, not the crown, the side button. And from here, you can... Um, rotate the crown to pick the person you want to call when you once you're ready tap on the person and simply tap on that phone icon and it's gonna start calling uh, in my case my brother and of course once he accepts the call on the other side I can simply use the Apple watch to talk to him using the built-in microphone and speaker phone on the Apple watch alright so that brings us to the end of this video uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video and also you can go ahead and connect with me socially on Google+, Facebook and Twitter for which all the links are in the description below. Thank you again and I'll see you the next time. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, just throw them down in the comments section below.